Gigabit Internet is on its way to Austin. It's technology that some think will change the capital city. It's Internet 100 times faster than typical connections we have right now. It has the potential to change the way businesses operate. KXAN's Chris Sadegi joins us live with more on how the average person on an average day could feel the effects of all this. Chris? Well, Robert, some public buildings like City Hall and some schools will have the connection with Internet so fast with bandwidth so wide that video chatting with somebody will be like standing right there next to them. And that opens up a lot of possibilities. The perks of working from home. Sean Flynn helps clients all over the country from his bedroom. It's great, but only as great as his connection. When people are getting online, the internet starts to slow down. Those process bars can take a little longer. Not good when you constantly have to up and download. So you get these slow down, you know, because the internet's getting choked off. But a gigabit can change it all and leave a huge imprint in the economy. That's why everyone was so excited on Tuesday when Google pulled into town. Uploading video is going to be awesome for things like voice chat or high definition video conferencing. We've seen the grainy Skype and other video chats that often drop out or get interrupted. Not with a gigabit. You're going to be able to see like every pore on the person you're talking to. Internet so fast, so clear, it's expected to attract more business to Austin. Because as Sean can tell you, things will just be easier. I think it's going to have a, a very good impact on the amount of work that I can do. With a gigabit, those 30 and 40 minute downloads wouldn't even last long enough for him to check his mail. This would only take about 16 seconds to download. And Google says the video chat capabilities with the gigabit are so sharp, they gave the example that healthcare professionals will be able to check on patients just using a tablet or a smartphone. We're live at City Hall, Chris Sadegi, KXAN News. And despite today's announcement, there is still a long wait for this faster service. Starting today, Google is letting you sign up to get updates on when the service is coming to your neighborhood. Early next year, based on interest, the company will choose which neighborhoods in Austin get this service first. Then in the middle of the year, Google Fiber will launch in the first batch of neighborhoods. Two years ago, Google announced it would launch this service in Kansas City, Missouri. Neighborhoods started getting that service there last summer. Online now, we have more information about how you can sign up. Just look for this story in the top stories section at KXAN.com. Scroll down and you'll find a link to the Google Fiber sign-up page. Just fill in your email address and zip code and you'll be standing by for more information. Google has not said exactly how much this service will cost here in Austin, but we have a pretty good idea based on what the company charges now in Kansas City. People there pay $120 per month for gigabit internet and a TV package. The gigabit service by itself is $70 per month. The company also offers a slower free internet service, but to get it you have to pay $300 for a construction fee. Now we spoke with a former Google insider today who offered perspective on the motivation behind Google's expansion plans. Former Google Europe Chief Operating Officer Ben Legg says Google Fiber Service is not just about boosting the company's bottom line, it's about making sure you have more choices when it comes to better service at better prices. I live in Kansas City. I'm in the area where Google Fiber is going to be rolled out and 40% of my neighborhood has signed up. So you know, I very much doubt that um, AT&T or, or other suppliers would want to lose 40% of their business, so they ought to be announcing massive infrastructure upgrade plans. Uh, and I don't think Google's seen the right level of reaction, so they're rolling out to Austin. That competition may already be coming. AT&T wants people to know that Google won't be the only game in town when it comes to gigabit internet service. In a news release sent out shortly after today's Google event, AT&T announced that it wants to build its own advanced fiber optic system in Austin. The company did not say when that might happen or how much its customers should expect to pay. Already referred to as Silicon Hills, Austin could see a similar trend to Kansas City after today's announcement. Many predictions point to even more tech companies coming to Austin. Google's expansion gives more clout to the local high-tech community. We're going to see a lot of ripple effect from that. This is pretty massive news for the city. Uh, you know, following in the footsteps of what we've seen in Kansas City, there's been a lot of uh, startups cre created. And coming up new here at 6 o'clock on KXAN, we'll tell you why companies already established here just can't wait to see the impact Google, Google Fiber makes on the local tech sector.